the last class we have studied about exercise 4.1 so today we shall learn exterior angles what is meant by exterior angle the exterior angles of a polygon are found when each side is extended here these two are the examples of polygons so this is the figure of triangle this is the figure of rectangle so in this figure here we have a three sides triangle always have a three sides so first label the figure m n p okay here this is the rectangle the vertices names are m n p we know that in triangle we have a three sides and three angles and three vertices so p m m n and n p are said to be a sides so each side is extended extra angles means when the sides is extended so p m is a side if the side is extended here if the side is extended so this forms a extra angle here this is said to be a exterior angle give the name as a one angle one okay this is said to be a what here exterior angle okay same as pn is also side so when the side pn is extended it forms a exterior angle so this is said to be a exterior angle same as mn is also a side of the triangle so yeah, when the mn is extended then it forms a one more exterior angle exterior angle so here total how many exterior angles are there here in the triangle we have three exterior angles when the side of the figure is extended it forms a exterior angle same as in rectangle so this is the example of rectangle here again in the rectangle we have a four sides pq qs sr rp so same when the side each side is extended here pr is a side which is extended then this is a said to be a exterior angle same as rs rs is a one more side when it is extended it forms a exterior angle and here qs is also a side of the rectangle when it is extended then it is it forms a exterior angle same as qp qp is also a side when it is extended then it forms a exterior angle so in the rectangle four angles four sides four exterior angles and four vertices so it is the definition of uh, exterior angle exterior angle means when the side is extended here when the side is extended here exterior angle and this is said to be a interior angle here this is a interior angle yes okay it is a interior angle here uh, exterior angle is a supplementary to, supplementary to the interior angles of course it forms a supplementary angle or we may say that it is, it is a form of linear pair of angles just observe this figure here it forms a linear pair of angles here the adjacent angles of the adjacent angles of exterior angle and interior angle is add up to always how much 180 degree here the interior angle plus exterior angle is equal to always 180 degree this is the is the form of linear pair of angles exterior or angle plus interior angle is always equal to the 180 degree so next topic is sum of the exterior angles of any polygon is 360 degree 
here now only we learn that when the side is extended it forms a exterior angle so angle 1 angle 2 angle 3 are said to be a exterior angles now we have to show that the angle 1 plus angle 2 plus angle 3 is equal to 360 degree. Here we have to show that the sum of the exterior angle of the any polygon is always be a 360 degree. So I will show a prior theoretical proof. Okay. Here angle 1, angle 2, angle 3 are the exterior angles. Here what we have to prove? To prove angle 1 plus angle 2 plus angle 3 is equal to 360 degree. We have to prove this condition. So let's start the proof. Now and I told you that exterior angle plus interior angle forms a linear pair of angle. This is an exterior angle. Yes, and this is an interior angle. Yes, this is a said to be interior angle, this is said to be an exterior angle. Exterior angle means the angles are outside of the figure. Interior angles means the angles are inside of the figure. So, interior angle I give the name as a A. This is A, this is B, and this is a C. Okay, the angle names A, B, C. Now, just observe this figure okay here it forms a linear pair of angle so we may know that exterior angle plus interior angle is always equal to 180 degree the linear pair of angles definition is the adjacent angles whose add up is always 180 degree a and angle a and angle 2 are the adjacent angles when we are adding these two angles its add, its addition is always be a 180 degree so right here angle a plus angle 2 is equal to 180 degree which is a form of linear pair of angles Linear pair of angles is a notation of angle. Okay. So, same here we have one more condition. Just observe this figure here. Okay. Angle 1 plus angle C. Here, angle 1, angle C are the adjacent angles whose add up is always 180 degree. Angle 1 plus angle C is 180 degree. So, right here. Angle 1 plus angle C is equal to 180 degree because again it is a form of linear pair of angle. Same as now, just observe this figure here. Angle 3 plus angle B is because this the, uh, the adjacent angle whose add up is always be a 180 degree. So angle 3 plus angle B is 180 degree. So right here, angle 3 plus angle B is equal to 180 degree. Here we have a three linear pair of angles. Angle A plus angle 2 is equal to 180 degree. Angle 1 plus angle C is 180 degree. And one more uh, linear pair of angle is angle 3 plus angle B is equal to 180 degree. So, give this name, uh, name as the equation 1, 2, 3. This is the equation 1. It is an equation 2. And this is an equation 3. So, now I am uh, going to add equation 1 plus 2 plus 3. I am going to add equation 1 plus equation 2 plus equation 3. So, when we are going to add the equations, we should always be a add separately for left hand side and right hand side. So, first we have to add the left hand side. Here, left hand side of equation 1 is angle A plus angle 2. Next, we are going to add keep the addition symbol. Next, equation 2 of left hand side is angle 1 plus angle C. Next, equation 3 of left hand side is angle 3 plus angle B. Which is equal to, next we have a sign of equivalent sign. So, write the symbol of equivalent sign now. Next, we have a right hand side of equation 1 is 180 degree. Plus, uh, right hand side of equation 2 is 180 degree. Plus, right hand side of equation 3 is again a 180 degree. 
now we have to make a separate for interior angles and exterior angles here angle a angle b angle c are the interior angles so i will write the separate here angle a plus angle b is here i will make a separate the interior angles angle b plus angle c okay next add the write the symbol of uh, addition next to separate the exterior angle angle 1 plus angle 2 plus angle 3 so angle 1 plus angle 2 plus angle 3 which is equal to 180 degree plus 180 degree plus 180 degree is the 540 degree next just observe this condition already learned that the sum of the angles of a triangle is always be a 180 degree so the sum of the interior angles of triangle is a 180 degree which is a property of angle sum property of triangle which is we already learned this condition in the last videos so angle a plus angle b plus angle c is always equal to how much here 180 degree so write the extra angle as it is angle 1 plus angle 2 plus angle 3 which is equal to 540 degree 180 degree the constant number when it goes to the right hand side plus 180 degree become a minus 180 degree so right here angle 1 plus angle 2 plus angle 3 which is equal to right 540 degree as it is so plus 180 become a minus 180 degree so 540 minus 180 degrees 360 degree so we showed that therefore uh, therefore angle 1 plus angle 2 plus angle 3 is equal to how much 360 degree this is the theoretical i show you the sum of the exterior angle of the triangle is 360 degree so angle 1 plus angle 2 plus angle 3 is how much we get here 360 degree you may apply same condition for the other polygons as a rectangle quadrilateral you get a pentagon hexagon for any number of sides the exterior angles the sum of the exterior angles always be a 360 degree So these are the example of convex polygons. Here, the uh, the sum of the exterior of uh, any exterior angle of any polygon is 360 degree. Here, now only we prove the example on triangle. Okay, it's angle one plus angle two plus angle three is a 360 degree. Same we can apply for same condition for a so, quadrilateral okay. has the four sides. Uh, angle uh, here. Uh, here we have a uh, four extra angles in this figure angle one angle two angle three angle four so we can apply that condition to this uh, figure also here this is the also example for polygon so angle one plus angle two plus angle three plus angle four is how much here 360 degree so this is the example of pentagon here total how many angles are the start here angle one angle two angle three angle 4 angle 5 these are the exterior angles whose add up is always be a 360 degree the sum of the exterior angles of uh, pentagon is 360 degrees so right here angle 1 plus angle 2 plus angle 3 plus angle 4 plus angle 5 is equal to 360 degree here you may select the any polygon is the its the exterior angle is always add up to a 360 degree this is the condition for sum of the angles of any polygon so the sum of the angles of any polygon is always how much here 360 degree.